Hello, welcome viewers. In this short session, we will go through business case theme in for Prince 2. The first part of the discussion, we will cover why business case theme is important and we will follow the guideline mentioned in the Prince 2 documentation. So, OK, don't waste time. So we clearly go to the uh, Prince 2 site. So in this session, basically overall the business case we will cover. What is the uh, maintaining the business justification and what is the relationship between output outcome and benefits and how to develop and maintain a managing a business case and what is the requirements for the business case theme and investment appra appraisal techniques. So for as usual for the key message, if we see that business case theme that why we need the business case theme because it is a it is a establish a mechanism to judge whether the project is uh, the project is desirable, viable and achievable. That first you need to consider three things that it is desirable and it is viable. That means it is continuously. It is OK. Maintain the cost and everything and most of important thing that is it is achievable. That means uh, why you uh, making the investment uh, investment? So that is the important part. So key message we got. So uh, Prince to delivers the outputs in the form of products. So by which the results in changes in the business. These changes create outcomes. The outcomes allow business to realize the benefits that are set out in the business justification for the project. So some example if I give uh, like what is the outcome outcomes uh, output benefit and this benefit. Let's say uh, you have created a new sales system. So that is the output and what is the outcome? The sales order are processed and more quickly and accurately. So this is the outcome. So you process for faster. And what is the benefit if you implement this new sales or, uh, system? The cost are reduced by 10% and revenue increased by 10% annually. And some disbenefit might be that some customers might perceive that the new system provides poorer customer service. So this uh, one, this with this example, we uh, understand the what is the relationship between outputs, outcome, and benefits. Let's proceed further. The so desirable means the balance of cost. That means the benefits and the risk. Viable means they are able to deliver the products. The achievable whether use products is likely to result in uh, outcomes and resulting benefits. So this the business justification uh, you can maintain in the business case. So we know that some stakeholders uh, are key stakeholders for this uh, project. One of the key stakeholders is uh, user representative. So when you basically uh, use the project uh, products, so some benefits are uh, who are the main benefits? Uh, basically the user because they will realize the benefit after the products are provided by the project. So executive is responsible for ensuring that benefit is specified by the e user representative. So if you see this uh, diagram, it will give some highlight that project outputs these enable business changes um, and these business changes create the desired outcomes and which might be measured in benefits which I give in the above example. And for example, if for the desired outcome might create side effects and it can result further in these benefits. And the, the benefits it, it has achieve, help achieve or one or more strategy objectives as well. So this is the relationship between outputs, outcome and benefits what we discussed so far. And <clears throat> what is what are the requirements for the business case team? If you see that uh, in the beginning, I mentioned that uh, you make a project because you uh, have some desired outcome. And so that's why you need to create and maintain a business justification for the project, usually a business case, uh, Prince to con continued business justification principle, and review and update the business justification in response to decisions and events that might impact desirability, viability, and achievability of the project, and define management actions that will put 
place in ensure that the project's outcome are achieved and confirm that project benefits are realized. It ensures continued business justification principle and define and document the roles and responsibilities for the business case and benefits management define roles and responsibility principle. Uh, so Prince to record that two products are produced and maintained in the business case team. What we mentioned that one is business case that provide the cost benefit expected out. These uh, benefit risk time scales against which the viable is justified and continuing viability and tested. It is acceptable to using alternate document such as corporate business plan. And another important part is benefit management approach. Define the management actions that will be put in place to ensure that the project's outcome are achieved and confirm that the project benefits are realized. And the PINS2 business case is developed at the beginning of the project. Throughout the life cycle of the project, the business case is reviewed and updated and it develops and evolves. Uh, so we will see the diagram here. So uh, during the pre-project stage and initiation stage, the verify uh, there are four contexts here. So one is the developed business case. That means uh, there are initial stage of the project, the pre-project and initiation stage. So this stage you see that verify the outline business case and also the verify the detailed business case. So if it is so, so this developed business case is basically if, uh, till the initiation stage of the project. And subsequent stage, uh, and uh, even after post project, we see the maintained business case where verify detailed business case and each of the stage we review that whether the business case is OK, maintain the cost and everything. And finally, we confirm that uh, the benefits is realized. So up to now we discuss this uh, uh, part of the business case theme. Later we will discuss further part like developing the business case justification what are, who are the responsible and other parts so thanks